All right, we're here with Coach Grove. Coach, first of all, beautiful day for uh, spring football. Uh, how have things been going out here so far? Well, I think things are going well. I think uh, you know, our guys are working really, really hard. We've got a really good uh, uh, pulse of the team right now. You know, the attitude's good. Uh, everything's upbeat. Uh, uh, I think we're getting a lot of work done. We're not playing great yet, but uh, that's typical in spring. We're looking at a lot of different things, but things have gone well so far. What's your biggest focus uh, in the spring? I think young people, getting the young guys that didn't play last year, especially kids we redshirted. Uh, you know, we got some other young guys, some of our sophomores. You know, some of the old guys we know pretty much about. But uh, right now with some of the injuries we've got, everybody's gotten a lot of work. Even some of the old guys are getting maybe a little more work than we normally would give them. But I, I just uh, think for more, more than anything else, it's a good time to look at the young guys. Uh, you have a few practices under your belt. Any of the young guys particularly stood out to you? Yeah, we've got a bunch of them. It would be hard for me to, uh, you know, to start singling guys out, really. I think one of the guys I'm very pleased with is Orville Reynolds, you know, who we played as a true freshman and probably didn't want to but had to. And, uh, you know, he's starting to come on now, so that's good to see. He's playing a slot uh, where camp would be. With camp being down with the ankle injury, uh, Orville's getting a ton of reps, and that's been really, really good for him, I think. You know, just a, a lot of these young guys, uh, guys that we were really excited about last year when we redshirted. A guy like Zach Gordon, tight end, is doing some good things. Uh, uh, just a, a, as you go through all these young guys, I don't think there's one right now that we're disappointed in. I think we're really excited about the, the young class. Now, I know you have a lot of injuries this spring, which I'm sure you don't want, but at the same time, has it given some of those younger guys a chance to take a bigger role than maybe they would have otherwise? Oh, yeah, no question about it. Uh, you know, depth is a, is a concern for us. That's why it's important that the young guys get the work. And uh, some of them are getting more than they need, honestly, with, with some of the injuries. But it's been really good. You know, we mentioned uh, how good it's been for Orville Reynolds. Uh, I hate to have camp down, but it's been really good for Orville. And I think uh, a lot of our young players, a couple young offensive linemen are getting a lot of work. A couple linebackers are getting a lot of work. Uh, you know, just all over the field, it's 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 young people but I think going forward the nice thing is when we get to the end of August get ready to play the season a lot of these old guys will be be the bell cows for us. Now that you've got a few practices in the books you're kind of moving into the heart of the spring practice season are you looking for things to kind of sharpen up a little bit is that what you're looking for? It's going to be hard to do that uh, I think uh, you know probably being a little bit sloppy will be uh, the theme throughout spring because we give everybody an opportunity in spring. Uh, not just scholarship players. Our walk-on players are getting a lot of looks right now. This is really a competitive time for us uh, individually. Uh, you know, football's a team sport, but for us right now, each kid at each position, uh, we're trying to give him as many repetitions as we possibly can because, honestly, when we come back in August, we, we pretty much set on our lineups and who's going to play. So we're trying to figure out not only the – scholarship players right now that have a chance to help us in the fall but there may be a, a handful of walk-on kids here that have matured enough that, that they need to get on the field so we're trying to figure out who the guys are right now and we'll we'll continue to do that there's not a lot of continuity when you're doing that our our first team may be mixed in with a bunch of guys that are fighting for positions right now that may not be first team in the fall but we're trying to give them as good a look as we can all right thanks a lot coach all right here with uh, the quarterback, Tanner Price. Tanner, uh, you guys are getting into spring practice here. Uh, I've had a few practice under your belt. Uh, what are you thought so far about how things have been going? I feel really good about things right now. I think that the team's in a really good spot. Our morale's really good. Positivity's great. Um, and, and I'm loving what we're doing offensively. So it's been a good spring so far, and, and uh, I'm excited to, to continue. Uh, you guys, I know you were all kind of disappointed last year not making a bowl game. Uh, I feel like there's like a different atmosphere around the spring this year coming off of that. Yeah, I think it's a, a much better atmosphere. We, we have a lot of great leaders with, within the senior class, and, and uh, I think everybody's really focused on, on this spring and, and making sure that, that we take the right steps uh, moving towards next year and, and are just really focused on getting back to bowl and, and having a successful season. What's the biggest difference between spring football and, and maybe preseason camp and fall football for you? Um, I think the, the spring football is never as um, – heavy as a load when you jump into to the fall it's pretty pretty serious and you know the season's right around the corner so uh it's a little bit more laid back but at the same time it, it's uh you know there's still that that focus and intensity
It's hard for you to believe this is your last spring practice. Yeah, I can't believe it. It's gone by so fast. So uh, got to make sure I make the most of this last year. Uh, what do you What do you tell the freshmen that have never gone through a spring practice before? Uh, you know, as someone who's been through it, what do you tell them? Uh, to just enjoy it, and, and uh, th this is a time for the younger guys to really uh, prove themselves and, and, and make a name for them. So to just enjoy it and, and uh, really focus and work hard during this time period. All right, thanks a lot, Taylor.